So welcome, welcome to another DIY video. Today, we're going to bleed the bricks. You remember um, I changed the ABS module already. So now I'm gonna bleed the bricks real quick. So basically this is how it goes. When you're bleeding the bricks, you can do it with two people or one. Today I'm gonna do it with one since it's only me and I'm gonna show you how. You will start with the one that's the furthest to um, the brick fluid. So my brick fluid is right here. Um, see, I already got the tire out, so I'm gonna start with this side right here, and then I'll go behind the driver's seat, and then I'll do uh, the passenger side over here, and then the driver. So, what you're gonna need is a bottle. You know, it could be any bottle. If you have a bigger car, you might need a bigger bottle. Get you a piece of this bottle too, right here. Go ahead and you mix your hole on top. Then you make another smaller holes right next to it. You put a little brick fluid in it. Then you put the tube in the hole. You make sure the tube go all the way down to where the fluid is at. You will attach the hose to this right here. Let me show you, right here. All right, so this is what it looks like after you make sure you put it in there and you're gonna use your wrench right here to loosen you see the bolt that's right over here yep so make sure your brake fluid is actually full mine is already full but I want to kind of put a little bit more because you're gonna be draining it So basically the process is you're gonna pump the brake all the way down for about five, six times until there's no bubble in the line. You can see right here, there's no bubbles or oh, there's one little one and it seems like it's going up but from from the top here and up there's no bubbles so that means that it's actually good so we can go ahead and close this back up and then remove it So then you proceed to repeat the process um, in the order that I showed you earlier. Now, um, there's no need to remove all your tires. I removed the first one that way I could show you exactly where and how to put the holes, but you basically don't need to remove the tires. As you can see, it's already night. Um, it is recommended to do this um, during the day, but I don't like to start anything and not finish it. So I'm gonna finish it anyway. After you finish to bleed all four, uh, you come back up and um, add more fluid and that's it, you're done. I just love when I do a project and it come out cool. Thanks for watching. Please like, comment, share, subscribe, and push the notification button. That way you don't miss any of our other videos. Thank you. Bye-bye.